Hey, ladies and gentlemen, I wanted to go over national polls here with you. It's the Fox News 5, uh, New York. And um, just to, I wanted to show you how could Trump or either Harris have a chance. But I think most of the Trump is going to be having a chance. And I want to show these states to you. So let's look at what the national polling is saying. So here, you see like there is a state of Nevada, Arizona, so these are the battleground states as of right now, Wisconsin, Michigan, Pennsylvania, North Carolina, and Georgia. Because last time, Georgia, they sent, went, had a blue wave. But on the other hand, a lot of Republicans thought it was a red wave. So let's take a look at, first of all, I think Georgia is a very important state as of right now because uh, what happens in Georgia is going to, Georgia and Pennsylvania and North Carolina are going to send a huge message to entire the results of the elections. That's what I'm thinking about. So here we go. First of all, Georgia, if if Georgia goes red, so Trump gets 235 electoral total, 270 electoral vote is needed to win. But Georgia is going to give Trump a advantage over Harris. And then you look at the North Carolina, of course, if that goes red, Trump gets 251. And Pennsylvania. So think about the Pennsylvania that goes into direction of Trump. He will have a 270. But I know for the state of uh, Wisconsin, that's going to be at some point it's going to be red. But if it's uh, it's going to be very close race right there. And then also looking at to the Michigan. Michigan is uh, I, I know Michigan is going to go blue for for sure. That's what I'm thinking. I would like to also know what you're thinking as well. So here, Arizona, very important ones. Um, if Arizona goes red, 291. And, of course, the state of Nevada as well. But they're going to try very hard to win this state. So look at each an individual state. Oregon, blue. Uh, California, of course, blue. And then our, uh, Alaska is red. And state of Washington, blue. Uh, Montana is going to be red. Idaho is red. Wyoming is red. Utah is red. Colorado, of course, hands down, is going to be blue. And then New Mexico, blue. Texas, red. Yep. And then, of course, Oklahoma, red. Kansas, red. And then you see Nebraska is going to be very close one. There's a district, I think, they're trying to show that district is going to be blue. So that's very close one. So South Dakota, North Dakota, red. Um, of course, Minnesota, um, blue and then Ida, uh, Iowa, red, Missouri, red, Arkansas, red, Louisiana, and then you see Mississippi, Tennessee, Kentucky, Illinois is blue, and then of course Indiana went red, Ohio, uh, West Virginia, and Virginia blue, but West Virginia is red, South Carolina red. Alabama and Florida both are red. And of course, New Year's going to be blue. And then Vermont is blue. And then New Hampshire blue. And then there is a little bit of a red there. But you see, uh, state of Maine went blue. So you now see New Jersey and then Connecticut and Massachusetts, uh, Maryland. And then there you go, Delaware. And then here you are, Rhode Island, and the DC is blue. So you see, what I'm looking at right now on the screen, it shows that Trump has an advantage over 297 electoral vote versus by uh, Harris 241. So this is going to be a very crazy one election. I know what they really, really want is to they want to get the state of Georgia and Pennsylvania. I feel like these are the battleground Wisconsin battle, battleground states that they absolutely want that, you know, for in their political advantage to win this election. I want to know what do you think the people over there and also I'm going to encourage all the people in Georgia to make sure there is no interference, any sorts of inf interference, and also Wisconsin, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania got to be the most important um, one right now. So that's why Trump is going back there very soon to do a campaign. 
Uh, same thing in Wisconsin. You see Trump is doing a mega uh, trash uh, or dump truck um, driving around. So this is he's the president of the people. So that's what I think. That's what I came up with. So thank you so much.